namaste to you all uh, in today's class i'm going to uh, give you some ideas regarding the world questions of b8 uh, first year compulsory english okay so i think you are ready for this uh, we will see the grammar part only in this class today let's see let me i start now uh, there are some questions you can just see the questions uh, yeah use the correct form of verb given inside the brackets so this type of question is asked there this is one question you can just see uh, for example so what may be the answer of this question you can guess there okay this is the question similarly second question we we were very and there is a blank space excited to meet again because we so which one can be the correct yeah. and the people are living longer and the treatment what will be which tense can be appropriate there we see again next one by the time they, they have reached 20 they uh, you can you have to supply the correct verb form given in the bracket next question you can see similarly the next one your yeah, short is too dirty it needs similarly the next one these are the question asked in see the answer here you is the correct form of the verb uh, in the blank space like ice melts it is the present simple and there now next one is we had not seen past perfect and this is present continuous and similarly there uh, future perfect tense and the in, next one e uh, only verb one infinitive and then next one is your short is dirty it needs to be washed uh, and the last one is simple past tense let's go there next one rewrite is sentence so that it has a similar meaning using the words in brackets as shown in the example the example is given over here for example it is highly likely that she will be uh, she will uh, beat me at tennis every you have to use this every the word every there is every chance that she will beat me at tennis so this is the um, correct way of doing doing this item uh, you can see here uh, yeah this is the question look at here yeah so these are the questions and you need to uh, this question you can find in grammar active grammar book also look at answer of these questions you can find in grammar active grammar page number 49d he is bound to win the race he is sure to play well there's a good chance of the match being cancelled there's no way i will be able to lift that weight they definitely won't want to eat rice and it's not impossible that she will come with us for run and i am not sure your ideas will work similar to the next one such matching items can be asked mm, match the sentence beginning to the uh, end uh, beginning to the ending parts correct ending parts it is also taken from page number 136 you can go and see the uh, beginning parts given here in the left hand side number 1 to 7 and then the options are given here in the left uh, right hand side you can match them the film has a heart heart and you see this is you know related with the compound uh, word heart heart breaking story like that she sits next to a blonde blonde hair blonde and hair can be matched and he will be made a half half you can see which one half skin half uh, breaking half hair half sided half spoken half matched okay maybe half sided so you can see the answer like this way see the film has a heart uh, breaking story she sits next to a blonde uh, blonde haired boy blonde haired means the the boy does not have any hair and he only made a half half you can see 
half sided shape and you have to be very thick skinned if you want to be a politician thick skinned and octagon is an eight uh, octagon is eight sided shape you can see there and they they are a very well uh, spoken and he is rather shy and quietly yeah quietly you can see there mm -hmm. they are well matched a couple and then next one is he is rather shy and quietly can do compounding word like a heart breaking blonde haired half hearted thick skinned eight sided well matched and quietly spoken long standing round table mild mannered so these compounding words you have to take care for exam see out of the following words are right which are commonly used in american english and which are in british english this type of question is uh, often asked in exam of uh, bh first year english so you have to take care of this type of questions also a toilet or restroom which one is what i have just given the list here you see british english biscuit is british and the same thing is called cookie in american english lorry in british english and truck in american english flat in british english and apartment in american english sweet in british candy in american taxi in british english and cab in american english queue in british and line is in in, in american similarly paraffin is in british and kerosene is in american english so you can see further like biscuit cookie lorry truck sweet candy taxi cab queue line paraffin kerosene nappy diaper you see in british english called nappy and then in american english diaper tap faucet, pram, stroller, fortnight, two weeks, toilet, restroom, curtains, drapes, trainers, sneakers. So this is how it is given, you know, British English and American English. You need to take care of this. Thing. Such questions can also be asked in the exam. Like, you know, the paragraph can be given to you. Edit the following um, text where necessary. And this type of text can be asked from effective academic writing book. So you have to study their effective academic writing books. And there are five, six uh, units, different types of essays uh, are taught there. And from there, this question uh, is asked. So such types of question can be asked you know, every year. You have to take care, okay? You need to find out the mistake there. Where are the mistakes? Look at, you know, uh, this is how it can be done. You can just screen, uh, yeah, uh, it's consumed. Uh, thank you so much. This is all.